Good morning to you. I'm Jennifer Bayless. Ruthie Holmberg, Development Director, and Laura Wingfield, Executive Director of Spark Hope, joins us now. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Good morning. First, Laura, what is Spark Hope? Well, Spark Hope, it stands for Single Parent Resource Center. And so we started in 2003. We were Mom's Closet Resource Center. And then in 2019, we changed our name because we opened up to single dads as well. So now we're Spark Hope. Ruthie, let's yeah. talk about Gift for Good Louisville. We know that's coming up on September 15th. It is coming How up. How is the organization getting involved? Well, we're getting involved. We're one of the nonprofits that we hope the viewers will look up on uh, Gift for Good uh, website and give to on September the 15th. Uh, Spark Hope right now tries to sponsor families, and we are sponsoring 22. We'd love to be able to sponsor more, but unfortunately, that takes a little more money. And so we hope that the people listening will remember us for Gift for Good Louisville and on the 15th, hit Spark Hope and give to us. We know that back to school is on the top of all parents' minds right now. You guys just had a big back to school event. Tell us about that. Absolutely. Well, go ahead, Laura. Well, we did we did a back to school event where we buy all the kids that are going back to school. They get three outfits or uniforms. Nice. They get uh, their backpacks with all their supplies, and then we take them to shoe carnival, and they get to pick out their own, you know, shoes and socks, mm -hmm. which is just amazing. They had so much fun. So it, it was a really successful event. All of our kids were sponsored. So that's just one of the things we do for our uh, for our parents that are in our program. What's next for Spark Hope? Well, you know, we really pr try to provide for single parents that are working and going back to school. And we have that accountability component. Mm -hmm. They need to show us that they're working. They need to show us their grades. And that's so important for them because they are examples then to their children. Mm -hmm. And so we provide a food pantry that is like a grocery store. Nice. We don't just give them a bag of food. Right. They're able to select their own. We give them gas cards. We help with rent during maybe difficult mm -hmm. times, unexpected expenses. You know, we we all get them. Right. The car repair, the unexpected medical. Uh, in my house, it always happens in threes yep. for some reason. Absolutely. And so we're there to help and we work with other people that volunteer their time, volunteer their resources. Um, again, though, in order to fully support those families, and that's what's important to us. We don't want to halfway do it. Mm -hmm. We want to fully support them. And that's why it's important that we are very cognizant of how many families we bring on. Um, we do Halloween costumes mm -hmm. for the children and <laughs> Christmas baskets yes, yeah. with gifts and decorations. One of our moms told us, and I never thought of this, is that Christmas time was so hard for them because mm -hmm. the kids would come home from school hearing about all these oh, other yeah. wonderful things, and she knew she couldn't do it. Mm -hmm. And now, because of Spark Hope, she can, and she's in the middle of midterms, and so it really yeah. took, or finals, it really took a big burden off of her. Oh, well, exactly. if, a, if somebody wants to get involved and help out Spark Hope, maybe send some money or volunteer, how can they do that? We are at www.spark-hope, and Spark is S-P-A-R-C-H-O-P-E dot org. And they will see a variety of ways that they can help and support our single parents in the Kentuckiana area. All right. Thank you, ladies, so much for everything you're doing for parents out there in our, in our region here. Thank, Thank you, you so much for having, for having us. us. You're welcome. Best Appreciate of luck. It.